Well, Robbie, imagine that you had 15 minutes in front of Bill Gates to convince him to invest in your company. Well, that's what the head of Eco Motors had a chance to do just two months ago. And he says he's created an engine that will revolutionize the industry. Don Runkle can't help himself. Engines are his thing. Engine power. It's what makes the world go around. So as the head of Eco Motors in Troy, he had no problem pitching his company's revolutionary new engine to billionaire investor Bill Gates. Made a pitch, uh, you know, in 15 minutes. PowerPoint said, here's how it works. He was interested. Invited me to dinner that night with just a few other CEOs. And that's how Eco Motors, a two-year-old Michigan company, ended up with $23.5 million from Gates to build the next generation generation of engine called opposed pistons and opposed cylinders so instead of an engine that that is firing the piston against a head which is all the engines that are around here ours fires against other pistons for those who don't speak engine don says it's smaller cheaper and more fuel efficient it could be an ideal fit for 100 million engines that run in cars planes boats and trucks around the world and it's being developed right here michigan and particularly the detroit area is the ideal place to build an engine company talented people around here terrific customers around here a supply base wonderful universities the engine is being tested in Livonia. The company, which has 31 employees, is expected to add at least 10 more positions in the next year. Don says this new technology is part of the wave of change in the auto industry. And when you have more efficiency, it's half the weight, half the size, so it's really a, a small package, very powerful, and lower cost. That's, uh, that's a pretty good combination of features. You probably won't be seeing Bill Gates walking around here in Troy, but you will be hearing more about Eco Motors as they go into this next year of development and testing and hiring more Michigan workers. Reporting live in Troy tonight, I'm Christy McDonald, Channel 7 Action News.